Looniform guy here and in this video we're going to be looking at the update to the addable triggers by farmer 5 tom on farming simulator 22 it's for all platforms pc mac and console i'm on ps5 here in the rock crawl map 4.91 megabytes to download this is changelog 1100 and it's quite a long list i'm going to go through it and then um, we're going to look at a few of these uh, the list is as follows fixed test areas did not fit all buildings fixed the icons at all unloading points of the products productions are now adjusted the icon of the dairy was too high the sugar factory sign now displays correctly changed the standard unloading station is no longer loaded from the main game as the version there causes a warning in the log and does not make ground adjustment Change level areas are now only as large as the triggers. Change clear areas are now only as large as... Okay, that's on there twice. <laughs> the hay store now accepts bales. I, yeah, we'll talk about that one. Also, a new liquid storage, new grain silo, and new multi-fruit silo. Right, so we have those. Right, so let's start, let's start from this end. The liquid silo. So... It's going to be under, I believe, containers. Yes, liquid storage. $5,000 to place. 5 million liter capacity. It is, by all means, uh, a container because you can fill it with all the different kinds of liquids. Uh, not slurry. So, water, milk, liquid fertilizer herbicide diesel exhaust fluid diesel and water so i have put some water in there a million point three liters so you can fill it yourself or you can uh, so uh, i believe filling is here taking out is here i have a trailer that i have also some water in there already let's get our help window on so uh pretty much works like any other uh, oddly enough the so yes you can refuel from it as well let's see here there we go unloading overloading the water water goes in there it says refuel but press l3 and you can fill your tank with let's say water fill rate is very slow just to warn you so five million liters would take five million years to to uh unload or to load actually onto a tank so just be aware of that fill rate is extremely slow here is a hayloft now we have straw hay and grass we'll go in here um i could not get any bales to load so if that's what is meant by um the hay loft or the hay it says the hay store now accepts bales i don't know what the hay store maybe hay storage but i i could not get it to accept bales i actually i can't couldn't get anything well it, i didn't try the uh i didn't try the um silos though uh no silos not accepting it either so um i'm not sure what was supposed to accept bales i couldn't um maybe there was one i missed possibly um the cell points did not take bales either right we do have a bale storage bale and pallet maybe that's what it was we have a pallet uh so in silos let's look at all the silos then and then we'll kind of go through them so here are the silos the hayloft loose product bale and pallet storage that's what i have here maybe that's what has been added the bales as, as, as along with the pallets we have a grain silo and a multi-fruit silo multi-fruit silo 10 million liters grain silo a more modest 1.6 million liters all right hayloft uh let's just go ahead and fill it with straw shall we i do have a rumbler van filled with well not filled a rumbler van with straw shall we say it should just fill 
there we go so it has filled with straw 250,000 liters all right we should be able to remove that 250,000 liters with a trailer right so there we go fill rate is standard base game fill rate all right now that we have that uh, let's just put that back in there we will need this so there we go fill point right there all right moving on let's move on to the next uh, next item is the bale storage I do have a bale in there and when they come up they come out over here and they go in over here they just disappear uh, what is the purpose of all these uh, well let's just uh, place down a shed and you can turn any building into a silo let's do multi fruit silo and spin it around like that place it like so uh, I would uh, I would do toggle free so that you can move it right up next to the barn area like so place it down and there you go you have turned um, a regular building or shed or whatever you want into so oh, I could have went, made it a little closer couldn't I although oh excuse me I guess I could have turned it it's maybe a little crooked I don't know there you go but that's the idea anyways like so those aren't quite lined up are they oh I maybe I had it twisted yeah that's the problem I didn't I didn't line it up properly okay sorry about uh, t toggling so there you go that's the bale now the next one is the grain storage this one has a fill area as you can see here but um, it only holds just basic grain uh, products the next one is the multi the multi fruit and the multi fruit holds everything all non liquid items and as you can see I have TMR in there right now like literally everything so let's take some TMR out and as you may guess uh, standard uh, fill rate for uh, for this maybe a little bit quicker but if you can imagine having 10 million liters of something in there it might take a while to um, to get it out just just so you know right we have two sell points we have a selling station and a large generic type selling station which you can close and open the gate can you still st sell stuff when the gate is closed I imagine you could but let's try it out they should buy everything we'll check it out in the cell oh it does not okay very good I know some of them do some of them don't but there you go if it's closed you have to open it and apparently it doesn't buy TMR okay maybe that's the issue I'll have to fill something else in there what about this other fill of uh, this other trigger right okay <laughs> let's check prices uh, selling station generic I cannot highlight it or or pick it uh, I have two selling stations it's interesting um, do, 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 do. selling station generic selling station 2 I must be on it yes selling station 2 um, it doesn't buy everything just uh, grapes corn 
uh, seeds, eggs, so um, kind of a select amount. And the other generic one that I can't is uh, wheat, not, oh, it's just all over the place. Uh, canola, not oats, um, weird, okay, um, right. Uh, just so you know, it's the generic selling station doesn't buy everything. Um, what else? Um, yeah, that's that's about it in a nutshell. I'm not going to go further into it. Um, I, there are probably a few other things I might have missed. I apologize if I have missed them. Uh, but there you go. That's the update to... The Edible Triggers by Farmer 5 Tom on Farming Simulator 22. Thank you all for watching, and remember, it's only a game, so till the next one, bye for now.